everybody. We're back at it again for another edition of Que Pasa, coming to you from Time at Montesil. Going to meet up with Ms. Kimber McCartan Foster from Destination El Paso. She's going to give us the scoop on some fun local events happening this weekend. And, oh, she's right over there. Hey, Kimber. Hey, Daniel. Where's your green? I'm wearing all green. What do you mean? <laughs> Okay, let's have a seat right here on this green chair. Very apropos. Now you have your green and I don't have to pinch you. Okay, good. All right. So tell me about all the cool things that are happening today. St. Patrick's Day events. There is the 6th Annual St. Patrick's Day Music Festival at Hoppy Monk. One of my favorite. They're going to have music all day by different local bands. They'll also have Irish beer and what they're calling Irish-ish food. What exactly does Irish-ish food mean? I'm assuming it's just kind of an El Paso spin on traditional Irish food. Okay. So that's happening at Hoppy Month today, starting at noon, and it runs all the way until 2 o'clock in the morning. All right. What else you got? And then there's also Artavino's Desert Crossing. They're hosting their annual St. Patrick's Day party this evening at 5 p.m. There will be traditional Irish food there, as well as lots of great beer. Tickets are $10 for adults and $5 for children. I just noticed your glasses are green, too. They are. You're ready. <laughs> A lot of people do work tomorrow on Friday, so if you can't go out on Thursday, there is something happening for the next few days, right? That's right. Out at Fort Bliss all the way until Saturday, they're having a St. Patrick's Day festival out at Freedom Crossing. Good food, lots of good drinks, Fungi Mungle, Joe Barone Band, Wildflower, Prime, The Rock Show, or just a couple of the bands that will be performing for a full schedule. You can go to Freedom Crossing at FortBliss.com. Look at that little guy. That dog is so cute. Let's have a seat right over here, right by Mother of Pearl, a great local record shop. Okay, so tell me about the insane inflatable 5K. Daniel, it's back, and it's better than ever. This is taking place at Escarate Park this Saturday. Everything starts at 8 a.m., so you want to arrive early and be ready for inflatable madness, literally. <laughs> it's just going to be neat and not a traditional 5K at all. Let's go in here. What is this? This is Chuco Relic, one of my all-time favorite stores in town. As you know, I am a homegrown El Paso girl. I'm a homegrown El Paso boy. High five to that. Yeah. This is an amazing store that just has local art by different El Paso artists. From paintings to t-shirts, Star Wars Loteria cards. Star Wars Loteria cards. Which I saw you looking at. Love it in here. Okay, Saturday, Kids of Palooza. Family fun at its greatest. This is the ninth annual event, and it's taking place at various locations throughout downtown El Paso. So each of those locations has something to do for the little nuggets? Yep. Crafts, games, everything is free. 10.30 to 5 p.m. on Saturday. Speaking of kiddos, who is this? This is my homegirl, Amory, <laughs> and this is her mama, Chelsea. And Chelsea is the owner of Chuco Relic. Yes, she is. Thanks for having us. And thank you, Kimber. We'll see you later. We'll see you soon. Don't forget, you can always find more information on cool upcoming events. Just download the Visit El Paso app from any of the app stores. Have a happy and safe St. Patrick's Day, everybody.